How's it going guys? In this video I'm going to show you how to repair your uh, Sony TV if you have a flicker, a flickering screen. Uh, this is the model Sony KDL-46WL135 but also other Sony models uh, with the KDL-40 uh, or-46 or-50-52 uh, are having the same problem and the problem is the, the flickering screen and the ghosting image uh, sometimes it goes away after the TV turns on is on for about 5, 10, 20 or 30 minutes uh, sometimes it takes longer uh, so basically the problem with this TV is uh, the LCD panel itself but particularly the ribbons on the LCD panel and I'm gonna show you how to uh, go ahead and repair that um, basically you have to get something uh, either uh, electrical tape or something that puts pressure under the particular ribbon that's causing the problem. In this case I was able to isolate the specific uh, connector, the ribbon cable that uh, is causing this problem in this TV. So you do have to um, uh, take the TV apart. You have to take out the front um, the uh, this this part over here so there's some screws you have to take out there you have to take out the, the uh, front plastic cover and then after you take out the front uh, plastic cover you have to take out this uh, metal cover as well that usually goes uh, right here in front of the LCD panel and after you take out this uh, metal cover then you can uh, pretty much have a view of the uh, ribbons and in this particular case uh, the ribbon that's causing me the problem is this one over here all the way let me, uh, let me zoom in this one over here all the way to my right at the very corner uh, notice that if I put some pressure on it the ghost in images just goes away and if I fiddle with it then it comes back okay so this is what I had to do in order to uh, repair the flickering screen and uh, put some pressure as I was saying you need to put some pressure on the ribbon cable uh, that's causing the flickering so uh, what I did is I went to my local uh, Walmart and I got this uh, cornering uh, plastic uh, thing that goes, uh, usually they use this for uh, uh, for tables, uh, if you have babies around the house uh, you would put this around the corners of the uh, tables or the chairs or anything that's sharp to protect the babies and so this worked perfectly uh, so what I did is I cut a piece uh, it usually comes in a roll like this and so you just need a little piece and the good thing about this it has tape uh, on each side and so all you have to do is just take the uh, the uh, protective uh, to expose the adhesive and um, it's already cornered so all you gotta do is just cut a little piece and then put it underneath this uh, metal frame so I've already cut, cut a piece and put it inside this metal and I put the screws back on so that I could put the pressure and now the flickering is pretty much gone there's no flickering, there's no ghosting images so you just need a little piece and uh, before you put it before you put the TV back together, leave it on uh, tap it a little bit, not too hard, just a little bit to make sure the flickering is gone and uh, turn it off, let it cool off and after the TV is cooled off for a few hours, turn it back on make sure there's no flickering anymore because uh, sometimes the flickering uh, comes back once the TV has cooled down so just make sure you uh, turn off the TV, let it cool down and then turn it back on and um, if you don't see any more flickering, well that uh, should do it uh, once again just uh, just cut a little piece and uh, put it right at the corner on top of the ribbon cable uh, so that you could put some pressure on that ribbon cable uh, that's causing the problem thank you for watching this video, uh, I hope you liked it uh, Please like and subscribe for future videos and don't uh, forget to comment if you have any questions.
Thank you.